You're watching News Epicenter here on CNN News 18 with me, Poonam Burde. Investigation in the now withdrawn Delhi excise policy has reached the doorstep of the Chief Minister of Delhi, Arvind Kejriwal. He's been summoned by the CBI on Sunday for questioning and he is going to appear for it as confirmed by the Aam Aadmi Party. The CBI confirming to CNN News 18 that the summons to Kejriwal are as neither a witness nor an accused in the case. Now, if you recall, Kejriwal's deputy and the man at the helm of the liquor policy, Manish Sisodia, has been in jail for two months now. This is the first time, though, that the agency has summoned the chief minister, Arvind Kejriwal himself. But they say that the investigation is a follow-up one. The probe has led to Arvind Kejriwal being questioned because several of the accused in this case have named him during the course of their interrogation. It is alleged that a bureaucrat of the excise department in Delhi during the interrogation of this scam has come out and given a statement to the CBI that Sisodia had called him to Arvind Kejriwal's residence. As per the statement of the bureaucrat, Sisodia verbally asked him to prepare a draft to increase the commission for liquor traders. Of course, all this is in the realm of allegations needs to be proven in a court of law. But these are statements that have been made by the accused, some of whom who have turned approver as well in this particular case. It is being claimed that Samir Mahendru had told the investigating agency that Arvind Kejriwal made a video call on FaceTime from Vijay Nair's phone. He told them that Vijay Nair is like my child. He trusts them, is what he had said. Samir Mahendru then claimed that crores of rupees were given in this case on the orders of Arvind Kejriwal, most of which the allegation is that were used by the Aam Aadmi Party in the recently held Goa elections. Now, this is not the only link or the only mention of Arvind Kejriwal as far as the accused in this particular case go. Another accused, Amit Arora, also spoke about Arvind Kejriwal and Vijay Nair and their connection during his questioning. Now, back in December, Amit Arora's remand note read something like this and I'm going to take you through the excerpts of what that note read. It said that a rough draft report was given in March 2021 when C. Arvind, the bureaucrat in question, was called to Arvind Kejriwal's residence. Vijay Nair, who orchestrated the entire scam, is a close associate of Arvind Kejriwal. That is what the remand note read. That's not what I am saying. Vijay Nair is not an ordinary worker of the Aam Aadmi Party. He is a close aide of Arvind Kejriwal. That's the connection that was made. Vijay Nair functions from the camp office of Arvind Kejriwal was another claim that was made. Now remember, Vijay Nair is someone who is under arrest and is under investigation of the agencies as far as the excise policy goes. So come Sunday, Arvind Kejriwal is going to be appearing before the CBI for his summoning. The Aam Aadmi Party has claimed this is nothing but witch hunt. The BJP, on the other hand, says that this is a due process of law. Why question it? That's our big debate tonight. हुआ है जो भी डीलिंग हुई है वो अरविंद केजरीवाल के घर पर हुई अरविंद केजरीवाल के कहने पर हुई तो इस बात का जवाब तो अरविंद केजरीवाल को देना पड़ेगा दिल्ली के मुख्यमंत्री के खिलाफ अरविंद जी के खिलाफ मोदी जी ने ये साजिश रचना शुरू कर दिया Before I open this up to our panelists joining us on this debate, uh, let me get across a word from my colleague Ashish Mehrshi. He tracks both the ED and the CBI. Let's get a sense of what really the case is and why these summons have been sent to Arvind Kejriwal. Ashish, do tell us what the investigation so far has revealed, which is why the probe has now reached Arvind Kejriwal's doorstep. So there are two areas of concern for Arvind Kejriwal. The first area of concern is about a video call which was made by Vijay Nair to Samir Mahindru, who is the owner of Indo Spirits. And we all know that Indo Spirits was a blacklist, blacklisted company. And despite that, uh, you know, the, uh, the Aam Aadmi Party government decided to give liquor license to, to Indo Spirits. Now, interestingly, he says that, uh, you know, in that video call, Arvind Kejriwal had allegedly told Samir Mahindru that he's my boy, that's Vijay Nair. And interestingly, Vijay Nair is not a small man or an ordinary man. He was staying in the house of Kailash Dhanu, who is supposed to be the minister in the, in the, in the Aam Aadmi government in Delhi. Now, somebody who is basically a private individual, who was basically handling the social media policy, was basically not only social media, another media, but he was staying in the house of Kailash Dhanu. 
this is one area of concern. The second area of concern is about the policy. So the policy was twisted in turn. We all know that policy was basically twisted when the South lobby individuals, you know, people who basically benefited out of the entire policy, they were allegedly staying in a hotel in Oberoi Maiden. Now, interestingly, this policy was basically of 36 pages. People staying in the in the Oberoi Maiden, they used a, the business center of the hotel. And interestingly, 36 pages of photocopies were done by them. This is on record. That is what the details the CB and the ED have. And it is, it's, it, there is a big question that is it a mere coincidence that 36 pages of policy was also equal to the 36 policy of, uh, pages of policy uh, or, the, or, or the document that uh, the photocopy was done by these individuals. Mm. Now, interestingly, C. Arvin, who, is, who was the secretary of, of Manish Sisodia, he's on record spoken before CBI and ED and that said that the, there was no mention about increase in commission during the GOM meeting. Not only this, there was no increase, there was no uh, uh, discussion on the uh, on the wholesale trade being given in private hands. So there were two changes which were done. One yes. was giving the wholesale trade in private hands, and secondly, giving handing over handing over the uh, the percentage of of profit or commission from six percent to twelve percent. Now the allegation by the CBI and the ED is that. This increase has happened only because the 6% was supposed to be commissioned, which was equivalent to around 100 crore rupees. Now, interestingly, the CBI and ED during their investigation, they have been able to find out a certain money trail. Now, this money trail, if you see, is about money leading to a Goa, to Goa election. They have been able to find out that huge amount of cash was distributed to to basically workers of yes. Aam Aadmi Party. Sorry to interrupt and you there, uh, Ashish. We'll come back to you. But the Aam Aadmi Party's uh, spokesperson and a minister in Delhi, Atishi, is now addressing a news conference. Let's cut across. And Pradhan Mantri Narendra Modi ji ko ye kehna chahti hoon ke Aam Aadmi Party humare neta Arvind Kejriwal humare party ka ek-ek vidhayak ek-ek karyakarta आपकी धमकियों से डरने वाला नहीं है आम आदमी पार्टी का जन्म एक भ्रष्टाचार विरोधी आंदोलन से हुआ है हमारा जन्म ही इस देश के भ्रष्टाचार के खिलाफ लड़ने के लिए हुआ है आप चाहे हमें सीबीआई का नोटिस दो आप चाहे हमें ईडी का नोटिस दो आप चाहे हमें जेल में डाल दो आप चाहे हमें फांसी पे टांग दो लेकिन हम देश की जनता के लिए लड़ते रहेंगे हम भ्रष्टाचार के खिलाफ लड़ते रहेंगे और आखिरी दम तक जब तक आम आदमी पार्टी के एक एक नेता में एक एक कार्यकर्ता में आखिरी सांस तक भ्रष्टाचार के खिलाफ लड़ने का दम है भ्रष्टाचार के खिलाफ लड़ने का जिगरा है हम आपकी ईडी और सीबीआई की धमकियों से डरने वाले नहीं है धन्यवाद This is intimidation and we're not going to be scared. That's the Aam Aadmi Party's view. And I want to uh, put across this question to the spokesperson of the BJP who joins us on this broadcast, Shazia Ilmi. Ravi Shivastav, uh, political analyst, and Satendra Singh, uh, former deputy director of the Enforcement Directorate, also with me. But Shazia Ilmi, the Aam Aadmi Party says that BJP ko Kejriwal phobia ho gaya. Which is why you're using all your might to go after the Aam Aadmi Party. It started with Satendra Jain, then Manish Sisodia, and now you're at Kejriwal's doorstep. So this is what is expected of them, right? They have nothing else to say. Like they don't have answers. If they were to be asked, and why is Delhi government being accused of favoring large distribution companies by stipulating conditions such as annual turnover of rupees 150 crores, and how how was it a conscious decision of the group of ministers, which included uh, Manish Sodia, and now we'll know whether Arvind Kejriwal was there or not, to create a monopoly of large companies by eliminating small players. Mm. When it comes to all the testimonies that have been collected from Sabir Mahindru, Vijay Nair, as well as interception of phone calls and FaceTime calls with direct links with the CM, and as to what was the need uh, for, to destroy the phones uh, that were used at all the SIM cards the day the inquiry was ordered, and so many other reasons as to why the revenue uh, did not go up when the consumption uh, and sales went up, of, of, and why was our liquor lobby, um, um, you know, given favor over others, 
and there's so many i mean i can go on and on but sure. clearly this is the information that they must have answers to so instead of answering these very basic questions which everybody is asking there and i'm sure um et is doing the same they can just give those answers right mm. instead of going all over the country place and just say yes and sure. that uh, they extend they why they, not response to why not respond to specifics then ravi shrivastav why of, claim of, witch hunt is that the only defense the amadmi party has you know when you so uh, when you so completely um taken uh, in let her finish, yeah, made, let her finish you, first shahzad me you have made your point i want to get in ravi shrivastav non stop monologue if she finishes then i'll speak ravi shrivastav i've put the question to you you have the floor yeah. please go ahead thank you very much punam first of all since mr arvind kejriwal in the assembly of delhi exposed thousands of crores of black money being invested by mr modi in these crony capitalist companies and the all exposes he made since then it was very much expected i, I think sanjay singh already has said in his press conference that he had already uh, cautioned arvind kejriwal that this will come out now i don't know what capacity he has so been called you don't have an answer had, right Hey, come on, so yar! You, have you finished? Shazia Almi, you had Shazia Almi, you had your time you, uh, to make you, your I, point. I, I, I will come back to you for a rebuttal. All you are a victim of the verbal diarrhea. I will. Ravi Shivastha, no, Ravi Shivastha, let's be civil, diarrhea. please. Let's be civil. Let's use better language because yeah, let's be civil, Ravi Shivastha. Let's try and do it. Let's try and find our language. Shazia Almi, I also request you to please not speak over him. You had your time. Let him make his counter, and then I will come back to you. Ravi Shivastha, go ahead. She is in a very bad habit of uh, talking these uncivilized things in between. So you better keep <laughs> quiet. You, when your turn comes, you speak over. Now, <laughs> now first thing is that uh, Punam, I I want to talk about this ED business. I think Sanjay Singh made a uh, press conference for this. How they have busted the ear drum of the Chandan Reddy, and it is all on record. He has filed a petition in the Hyderabad uh, court. Then they are threatening his daughter. They are threatening his wife. I mean, this is the way of working by the so-called premier investigation agency, the ED, and this is how they are extracting these statements from the people. And on the basis of that, they are saying that we are on that reference. We are calling Kejriwal. It's not joking. Is he an is he an accused? Come on, shut up. But the CBI hasn't. Camera. The but press conference is on camera. But Ravi Shri Vastav, you can't deny that. But Ravi Shri Vastav, CBI has said that he is not. They are just examining him because several of the accused, not one, several of the accused have spoken of Kejriwal and the alleged link, and how Kejriwal was in the know. Then don't you think this is just the direction in which the probe would naturally go? Unam, that's a one person of statement against the other. It has to be proved. Exactly has, why the questioning is happening. Whatever is it that how corroboration is done to take both exactly sides of the story? Exactly my point. No, it is not. Unam, uh, Mr. Maharishi, Maharishi was saying, I don't know all these things. You know, going to Obrai Maidens, making a video call. How these things people make a person uh, a criminal or an accused? You know, I, I tell matter. you, when money is taken and when policy is changed to make money. and that money is used for corruption and for propaganda in goa by ill begotten means that in indian law is called considered corruption sir maybe it hasn't dawned upon you but this is plain simple exactly simple corruption none of so them have got you can defend the corrupt of the cut cut the main party but the fact is is disgusting hey cut the main party the nature of answering questions cut to say that you are a cut the main party role of vijay nayar Cut to say. Can you say one sentence? And Dinesh Arora, and you are cut to say one dar. And Parno, you have no answers. You go on Adani, Adani, Adani. Adani. You go on Ambani, Ambani, Ambani. You have no answers to give for yourself. Mr. Adani, the crony capitalist. Which is why Mr. Sodia Ji is in jail. Twenty thousand crores of money has been invested here by Mr. Sodia Ji. Which is why poor Sanjay Singh had no answer to give. It's all on record. Sanjay Singh has no answer. You answer. Everybody will answer. Now, Mr. Sodia Ji, it's a zabardast. Mr. Sodia Ji will answer you now. Jail to go. Mr. Sodia Ji will answer you now. Jail to go. Mr. Sodia Ji. Then now Shahzad Ali and Ravi Shivastav let's take a breath the political fight will continue but i also want to get in the investigation the aspect i also want to get in the investigation aspect of it which is why i want to get in the former deputy director of uh, the enforcement directorate satendra singh ji ye witch hunt hai agencies sarkar ke behest pe ye sara kaam kar rahe hain in this case modi sarkar ke behest pe punam ji ye aarop to पहले से लग रहे हैं जब भी किसी बड़े नेता को बुलाया जाता है तो ये आरोप लगा दिए जाते हैं 
लेकिन ये सरासर गलत है आप ये देखिए कि जब ये केस स्टार्ट हुआ था तब भी आरोप लगाए गए सरचेज हुई कि हमारे खिलाफ कुछ नहीं मिला है आइए हमें गिरफ्तार कीजिए आपके पास सबूत है तो धीरे धीरे इन्वेस्टिगेशन आगे बढ़ा एविडेंस आयोज ने कलेक्ट किए और उसके बाद गिरफ्तारियां हुई फिर कहा गया कि गिरफ्तारियां गलत हुई हैं लेकिन जो एविडेंस है वो कोर्ट ऑफ लॉ में रखे गए हैं मजिस्ट्रेट ने उसको एग्जामिन किया है और उसके बाद उन्होंने उनको जमानत देने से मना कर दिया इसका मतलब प्राइमा फेसाई इनके खिलाफ बहुत अच्छे एविडेंस इन्वेस्टिगेटिंग ऑफिसर्स ने कलेक्ट किए हैं कि इन्होंने भ्रष्टाचार किया है तो ये कहना कि ये मोदी गवर्नमेंट के कहने से हो रहा है विचंट हो रही है तो ये गलत है विचंट तो तब कही जाती जब डे वन पे इनको पहले गिरफ्तार कर लिया जाता बिना इन्वेस्टिगेशन के उसको विचंट कहते हैं या तो मुझे समझ नहीं आ रहा कि ये आरोप क्यों बार बार एजेंसी पे लगाए जा रहे हैं सिंह जी आरोप ये लगाए जा, जा रहे हैं क्योंकि उनका कहना है कि कोई तथ्य नहीं है अरविंद केजरीवाल को समन करने के लिए ना उनको आप विटनेस के तौर पर बुला रहे हैं ना उनको आप अक्यूज के तौर पर बुला रहे हैं आपके पास क्या सबूत है कि आप अरविंद केजरीवाल को समन कर रहे देखिए जहां तक सबूत की बात है सबूत तो जितना इन्वेस्टिगेशन अभी तक हुआ है उसमें कुछ एविडेंसेज सामने आए हैं उन्हीं को वेरीफाई करने के लिए केजरीवाल जी को बुलाया गया अब यह है कि वो एक्यूज हैं, विटनेस हैं, नहीं है ये सब तो इन्वेस्टिगेशन के बाद पता लगेगा ना अभी से क्यों ये आरोप लगाया जा रहा है कि ऑफिसर जब सीबीआई अरविंद केजरीवाल सीबीआई टू क्लैरिफाई इन वॉट कैपेसिटी दे आर कॉलिंग मिस्टर केजरीवाल as an accused Deekhi, as a witness as a supporter in the case as an intervener what capacity <laughs> no they have not clarified and mr singh who was talking Deekhi. on a very uh, high uh, high on a high pedestal that how ed conduct an inquiry does he know the chandan reddy's petition that he know that the medical report there that year yes, yes. that yes that that is on record that his wife has been threatened does he know that his daughter has been told how will you go to school This is how you are extracting the statement this from the people. This is this is your investigation. Yeah, then again, this is allegation. Yes, sir. Just or just or just or allegation. Just or 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 क्या जांच कर रहे हैं आप तो मैं आप जांच के नाम पे जांच के नाम पे हेरस कर रहे हैं लोगों को जांच के नाम पे टॉर्चर कर रहे हैं आप थर्ड डिग्री दे रहे हैं उनको जांच के नाम पर ये जांच है आपकी हमारी इतनी बड़ी एजेंसी के लिए मैं ये कहना चाहूंगा मैं तो मेरी व्यक्तिगत जानकारी में बात है ना आपकी जानकारी में है आप भी दूसरे के कहा हुआ बोल रहे हैं यदि आपकी व्यक्तिगत जानकारी में है तो ये आरोप लगाते हुए कुछ अच्छा लगेगा लेकिन मुझे आपकी व्यक्तिगत जानकारी में मेरी जानकारी में सतेंद्र सिंह जी मैं एक सवाल आपसे पूछना चाहूंगी बिकॉज आप एनफोर्समेंट डायरेक्टरेट के पार्ट रह चुके हैं मैं आपसे पूछना चाहूंगी जैसे रवि श्रीवास्तव कह रहे थे कि इस केस में सीबीआई को बताना होगा उन्होंने केजरीवाल को क्यों समन किया क्या वो अप्रूवर है क्या वो इंटरवीनर है क्या वो अक्यूज है क्या वो विटनेस है मैं आपसे जानना चाहती हूँ बाय लॉ डज द एजेंसी हैव टू मैंशन दैट वेन दे समन नहीं कोई जरूरी नहीं है कहीं भी ये नहीं लिखा हुआ है कि क्यों बुलाया जा रहा है या ये मैंडेटरी है मेंशन करना किसी को बुलाने से पहले बताना कि आप क्या हैं क्यों आपको बुलाया जा रहा है यदि ये होता तो ये को, कोर्ट किस लिए है हमारे यहाँ कोर्ट सम्मन को रिक्वेस्ट कर देते और एजेंसी को डायरेक्शन देते कि जाइए आप पहले बताइए इनके पास तो इतने बड़े बड़े लीगल जो हैंड है जो इनकी हेल्प कर रहे हैं या ये जिनको इन्होंने हायर किया है ये इतनी छोटी सी चीज है क्या वो इनको नहीं बता पा रहे कि ये गलत बोल रहे हैं कहीं भी लॉ में मैंडेटरी नहीं है कि ये बताया जाए कि आपको किसी ऐसे से बुलाया जा रहा है and ravish mastam no. as far as the investigation against manish sodia goes even then we had the narrative that was said by the aam aadmi party that this is nothing but vendetta and witch hunt he it was cutter imandar is what the aam aadmi party had said but it is the courts of this country that have denied him bail perhaps because let, they have found some credence in the case that the agency was trying to build it's the same courts the, that you want relief from isn't it let the court take their own time 
nobody is in a hurry let them do it let them satisfy themselves that's a fit case for a bail let them see that in the supplementary charge sheet third even then manish sodia's name is not there even after raiding his house in ancestral ancestral house his house in delhi everywhere they could not find even a rupee are his accused number 1 my dear friend where are you living yeah. But Shahzad Ali is still not being charge sheeted. But he's still not being charge sheeted. There has been one charge sheet, two supplementary ones, and yet there is no. Which is why the Aam Aadmi Party says that there isn't enough proof because you no, cannot charge sheet. No, no. As even as an anchor, you should know the basic facts that he's accused. That's the allegation the Aam Aadmi Party is making, ma'am. That's not what I am saying. I want to okay. So you are asking the questions. Where are the facts? Now these are the facts. Why was the commission increased from two percent to twelve percent? Why? Why was there was a kickback of six percent collected? Why it's were blacklisted fake, and manufacturing a, companies allowed to come to uh, to it's come? It's a fake charge. Why it's were wholesale given charge. to private players, which was against the law? What, why did the whole policy get reinstated? Are fake. The minute the charges are policy. fake. So the These are contemplated by you, all fabricated by you only. He's a sweet anchor. These charges are not even charged. Ravi Shivastav, Ravi Shivastav, you say these charges are fake, these charges are fake, and are being concocted by the BJP either on the Spanish or as a Indian politician. Ravi Shivastav, 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 Ravi Hollering up and going insane. So I think you should let me finish. These are very basic questions that are being asked. Sure. They have to answer these questions about about the commission, about the kickback, about the digital money trail, about what happened with Perno and uh, with the Indo Spirit. Uh, why was a phone call made? What is the connection between Samir Mahindra, uh, Manish Sisodia, and uh, Vijay Nair? These are very basic questions, so it has nothing to do with. And they try to complicate it and sound very intelligent. That in what capacity is being called? You know, Manish Sisodia went to the extent of saying that I was called, and they were trying to do Operation Lotus. CBI uh, wanted Kunal, to do the BJP. So there's any thing. There's any thing. I know the very well. 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 Sure. So now some points have been raised by the BJP. Ravi Shivastu, would you want to respond to those points? You Absolutely. say these allegations are fake and they are concocted by the BJP either on this debate or as a narrative as a whole. But why do no, you say that? These are questions. That's the policy. Sure. 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 Okay, let me just come in here. Let me just come in here, Ravi Shivastav, and let me ask you this: You say that these charges are fake because they have not been put on a charge sheet. Correct? Have I gotten that right? That there is no charge right. sheet against Manish Sisodia, right? Yes. Now the agency has three months before they file a charge sheet. Let them do it. Let them come out. February twenty sixth is when, February twenty sixth is when Manish Sisodia was arrested. So Feb- yeah, so May twenty sixth is the deadline for the CBI to file that charge sheet. Let We're still a few argument. weeks away from then. If they still Let don't it. file a charge sheet and name Manish Sisodia, then you can say these charges are concocted because there is no mention of it. But why so, not wait such, until then? Till such time, I'll I'll say that these charges are fake, concocted, and fabricated by the BJP only. These charges are not a part of any charge sheet as of now. When the charges charges are filed and the court approves them, that the charge these charges exist, then we will talk about it. Sure. Then the fact will come out. What sure, say, but why say why say that the CBI doesn't have any proof punishment. against Manish
भाग रहे हैं वो डिबेट से पार्लियामेंट में भाग रहे हैं डिबेट से कहीं राहुल गांधी को नहीं बोलने दे रहे अरविंद केजरीवाल को नहीं बोलने दे रहे उसको उठा करके सीबीआई का संबंध हमारे हैं कितना कितना डरे हुए हैं आप कह रहे हैं नैरेटिव इज बीइंग बिल्ड बट शाजिया नैरेटिव इज बीइंग बिल्ड बाय यू आर अपनी पार्टी व्हिच इज व्हाई वी सॉ व्हिच इज व्हाई वी आर मनी सुसाइया वेंट इन फॉर क्वेश्चनिंग आल्सो वी सॉ एन एंटायर रैली एंड प्रोटेस्ट मार्च दैट हैपेंड देर वॉज स्लोगन दैट वो बींग रेस मेनी वुड से दैट वॉज अरेटिव दी आम आदमी पार्टी वॉज ट्राइंग टू बिल्ड इज नॉट अ नैरेटिव दैट बीजेपी और द एजेंसी आर ट्राइंग टू बिल्ड शाजिया अपने लीडर को सपोर्ट करना चाहिए। फर्स्ट ऑफ़ ऑल लेट मी करेक्ट लेट मी करेक्ट रवि श्रीवास्तव जी पुअर थिंग कीप्स गेटिंग करेक्टेड बिकॉज आई दर प्रिटेज नॉट टू नो लॉ दिस इज बेसिक स्टफ एनी वे सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल केजरीवाल कुड नॉट हैव इवन अलाउड और डिस अलाउड मोदी जी टू स्पीक और नॉट टू स्पीक बिकॉज केजरीवाल इज नॉट इन द पार्लियामेंट वी टॉकिंग अबाउट डेली असेंबली एंड अरविंद केजरीवाल इज सी एम ियंसिस Can I come in? Charlie, yeah, go ahead. Please. When she does it, you don't stop her. I stopped her as well, Ravi Shivastam. I stopped her as well. I've been trying to tell Wait, both of you all to be civil. Forget about BJP. Charlie, forget about ahead. protests. Forget about everybody. They are very simple questions. They, why was a policy changed? And all the charges that are there of kickbacks, not just kickbacks, of commission, the phone calls, destruction of evidence, and all of that. One. Now after that, also. When the case is case is uh, the, the investigation is going on, instead of answering these basic questions, which I'm sure the officers and intelligence is asking, and of course which is merited because they are elected leaders, they have to answer. Now what happened to that money? Where did the kickbacks go? How was the money used? Especially when a digital money trail is there. So I don't know. Instead of answering questions, you go all over the countryside. Modi ji, Ambani, Adani, and you go on and on. Why? Just answer the questions. Samir Bahindru, Vijay Nair, Manish Sisodia, WhatsApp. I mean, FaceTime phone call, destruction of evidence, and liquor money, blacklisted companies, wholesalers, Can I respond now? Can I respond? Very basic stuff. Why trying to confuse? Nobody is sure. a fool. We know the case. Sure. Ravi okay. Shivastav, go ahead. Several allegations mm-hmm. being made. Several allegations being made by the agencies in this case. They, they, by they, the agencies in this case, all, all of which are under investigation. And then they took it back. All of which are under investigation. And if the Aam Aadmi Party says that we want to ensure that there is no corruption, then why not for the greater good let this investigation progress? The truth will be out. Isn't that what it, the Aam Aadmi Party okay. also wants? Now, now as an anchor, you reply by one no, question. No, they don't want that. Did Aam Aadmi Party ever? They don't go to jail. Jazzy Alvi, you had your time. The question was for Ravi Shivastav. Ravi Shivastav, go ahead. Did they ever ask anybody to stop any investigation? It is happening. Who is stopping it? Sure. Who is that? Who is worried? Who is afraid? Who is scared? Nobody. Do it. Keep on doing it. The whole world is seeing it. The twenty parties have gone to the president. That how you are by using the agencies, ED, CBI, income tax, uh, NIA, everybody to harass people. These are written on record. Entire opposition is united today on this. And fourteen parties issue. went to the Supreme Court also, but that petition wasn't uh, no, even entertained by no, the Supreme that's Court. That's wrong. Supreme Court said you bring out the specific cases. And exactly, they said you can't have you can't cases. have a preemptive rule. You can't have a preemptive norm for politicians. Chandan Reddy's case will go up to Supreme Court now. You watch it. Sure. The, the Supreme Court said individual me. cases can come the to ED us, and those individual cases, like in now. the case of Satendra Jain and Manish Sisodia, have been going to different courts. And in both those cases, bail has been denied by different courts of this country. Right. Let that bail take time. No worries. Let the court take their own time. Ultimately, it will reach to the highest court. Ultimately, it will be seen that where are the evidences. The evidences have to be incontrovertible evidences to be proved. But what the Mr. Modi is doing? The entire nation is asking questions today, and he's running no, away. No, I don't think so. He I think the nation is very disgusted by you. He is trying to gag the voice right of people and discussing is exactly people who came that. on the basis and of. Kind and of Ravi Shivastav, questions, and questions are being raised on one side of the spectrum. Questions are being raised on the other side of the spectrum as well. You you can't accuse the other party of running away while you don't answer the same questions either. 
No, no, I am not saying running away. What I am saying is that nation is asking the question today. Entire opposition is asking the question so, today. Who, who and Mr. To Modi is trying to silence That's every right. voice which is coming questions. against him. Where is this nation? Is it the way? Is As the democracy the nation, here, a democracy is in peril? I mean, what do you speak? Sure. Sure, you so know, questions are being raised, but let's come back, let's yourself. come back to the question at but hand and I Ab want Ab to Ab get in Satendra Singh Ab once again and I want him to have the last word before I end this debate. As far as the political fight goes, as far as the narrative between the Aam Aadmi Party and the BJP goes, we've all heard that. Shazi, I'll play Ravish Rastav. I have very little time on this debate. I need to get in Mr. Singh as well. I request you to please, you've had your time. Satendra Singh ji. Ji. ईडी की जांच हो रही है सीबीआई की जांच हो रही है एक्साइज पॉलिसी में ये एक्साइज पॉलिसी विड्रॉ कर चुके हैं दिल्ली की सरकार जी ऐसे काफी तथ्य हैं इसमें जिसमें प्रूफ जमा करने की जरूरत है जिसमें कोरोबरेशन की जरूरत है उस प्रक्रिया के लिए अगर जिन लोगों के नाम इसमें आए हैं उन लोगों को समन किया जाए उन लोगों को क्वेश्चनिंग के लिए बुलाया जाए तो क्या यह गलत है जी नहीं यही इन्वेस्टिगेशन का तरीका है कोई भी एजेंसी हो ईडी नहीं सीबीआई नहीं आप साधारण एक एफ दर्ज कराते हैं कि मेरी यहाँ एक्सीडेंट हो गया था गाड़ी का और दो गाड़ियां थी ये तीन लोग देख रहे थे वहां तो अब जो देख रहे थे आपने उनका नाम सामने है तो उनको बुलाएंगे तो वो ये कहें कि साहब हमें क्यों बुला रहे ये तो सरासर गलत है हमें जबरदस्ती बुलाया जा रहा है टक्कर तो उन दोनों की हुई थी इन्वेस्टिगेशन का एक तरीका है और ये कोई ये नहीं है कि भारत की एजेंसियां ही ऐसे करती हैं किसी भी क्राइम का इन्वेस्टिगेशन है पूरी दुनिया में एक ही तरीके से होता है एविडेंसेस कलेक्ट करना और उनको कोरोबरेट करना और वही यहाँ किया जा रहा है जी सो इट्स ड्यू प्रोसेस जहां तक ये बात है कि भी किसी के इशारे पे एजेंसी काम करती है देखिए मैंने मैंने जो मेरे सर्विस रही है वो पुरानी सरकारों में भी रही है इसमें भी रही है और जहां तक मेरा अपना व्यक्तिगत तजुर्बा है कभी भी कोई दबाव राजनीतिक तौर पर ऊपर से नहीं आता है जीवाल